Flip a coin. Heads. Okay. Okay. I took another practice exam. Um. Are you in a car? Ma'am, that is the worst thing you could do to me. Not confident in my ability at all. Hello, my name is Lauren and I'm a fourth year medical student. Still getting used to saying that. If you're new here, if you're not new, then welcome back. Welcome to the vlog. This will be a study vlog because I'm studying for step two currently. This will probably be my last dedicated diaries before my first fourth year rotation vlog, which is crazy. I'll talk about that later. It's seven o'clock on the dot, but I'm not in a drop top. If you know, you know, and I'm gonna get started studying. So let's go. We're gonna start with some Anki. We have time skipped a little bit. It's like maybe three, four hours since I last studied. It's currently 3.30. Oh, I'm gonna sneeze. Oh God. Oh God. My sneezes are so aggressive when I sneeze, even though this cat has lived with me for two years. Vako thinks it's like an earthquake and runs away. It's very offensive and rude. Anyways, it's 3.30 and I did a really strong two hours of Anki and then I was hungry and I wanted to eat and then I watched a show I ate and I was like, I might as well finish the show. And then I got on TikTok, worst thing ever. So here we are. And I need to salvage the day because I have stuff I need to do. Something that I realized in the past month is for me, I might study for like three hours and in my head I've studied for six because that's how it felt. So the people that actually study for like eight hours every day I don't know how they do it like I I don't know I don't know anyways um <laughs> anyways I'm in my car and I'm gonna let Siri decide where we're gonna go study so basically I have three potential cafes one of them is one I've never been to and then I have school i just don't want to like have my vlogs be too repetitive and then i'm just like doing the same things over and over again to the new cafe that i really like that i've been going to all the time i'm just worried that i don't know you guys might find the scenery kind of boring i mean since i've been there when i'm there and i'm like re-watching this back to edit i can tell where i am of course so i'm like oh i don't know if it's getting repetitive but as someone who's never been there then you might not even like think about it you might just be like oh she's studying somewhere you know I don't know let me know I'm not gonna study at school because I'm gonna be studying there next week because I'm gonna just study there after my rotations which <laughs> our two options for today are the cafe I've been going to very frequently recently and the new cafe that I've never been to now the issue is the new cafe their whole like unique thing or their appeal is they have a lot of like plants in there and if you saw my last vlog that whole thing with my like allergy skin itch hive attack has not gone away like it improved and then a couple days later it kind of came back and i've been dealing with it for like this is like maybe my third day in a row. It's better earlier in the day, but by the end of the day, I'm like dying. Like yesterday, it was so bad. And just now when I change into these clothes and I'm looking at like my body without clothes on and I see like these giant patches of like redness from me like scratching and the patches are like warm and I'm allergic to 
nature. So <laughs> I don't know if that's like the worst idea ever to go to that cafe, but I just want to do it for the vlog and I want to be boring, you know, and like be too predictable. So I'm going to have Siri flip a coin because I like when Siri makes decisions for me. So let's do heads is head to the new cafe. Tails is tail it back to the old cafe. Okay, here we go. Hey Siri. Okay, flip a coin. Heads. Okay, okay. Another issue is I've already had coffee like, and it's 3.30, if I drink coffee now I'm gonna have insomnia, so I'm not gonna buy coffee unless I'm dying, and I feel kinda like weird going somewhere for the first time and not buying something and just like using their facility but not actually buying anything, but whatever. <sighs> Let's go. I'm here and the parking lot's tiny and there's kids all over the parking lot. Oh, there's an adult walking in. Oh, two. Okay, that gives me some hope. All right, I left. I studied there for about an hour. I said it was like planty vibes. I actually was in a greenhouse, <laughs> which it was hard to focus because it's warm outside and I always dress to be in AC because I'm always cold and then there was like bugs. But I actually was like really productive in that hour. I did some more Anki. Anki's like literally never ending and then I answered all of my emails for like YouTube stuff. So I really needed to get that done. I answered a couple texts. These are probably like, probably like three years old. But when I was in there, there was like little specks falling from the sky of pollen. Cause there's plants everywhere. And I was like, yeah, I'm gonna die of an allergy attack. <laughs> this is like the allergy vlog, honestly. It's so bad. Oh. That actually feels really nice though. But yeah, I definitely am gonna shower the second I get home. It's currently five o'clock and I have 70 more Anki cards to do. And then I'm going to do You World. And that will probably be it. The service also was like not good in there. And the person next to me, literally wiping down my whole body. She's on a Zoom meeting and she didn't have headphones in the whole time I was there too. So like it was over an hour cause I was there for an hour. And I just feel like that's so inconsiderate. If you guys have a strong opinion, feel free to start a debate in the thing. But I just feel like you're in public. So you should have headphones in. Like I shouldn't be hearing what's going on in your meeting. I took another practice exam and um, <laughs> I got the exact same score as I did on my first one, which was frustrating. But it could have went the other way and I could have got a lower score. So it's not like it's the worst thing in the world. Like it shows consistency, but it's not like there's clearly no improvement. I was supposed to take another one this Sunday. Today's Thursday. So at this point in three days, but I'm not going to do that because <laughs> I just don't think there's been enough time for me to like demonstrate improvement and I can't get the same score three times at that point. It's like wasting practice exam so I'm gonna take my third one a week after this weekend so like in a week and a half probably depending on how much studying I can get done while simultaneously in my rotation which is gonna be a mess. Oh, this is shame. Dang. I took a bottle and I drank it on the pour me a glass my head is lifted in the pile trying to never come back I'm not rocking no protection got no space so Naked in the void, hug the pavement, I'm unable to get up, get up, get up, get up, easy to give up, give up, give up, give up, maybe I'll be done, be done, be done, be done, be done, be done, pains it with me blood, me blood, me blood, me blood. But I'm afraid to be seen now Every day is a slow start 
start But it's feeling like a speed round in my mental and it go far Like if I just slam on the gas I could go in the flash and abandon this whole world No more the pain, no more debating and no more mistakes doing no harm Oh God, see yellow is falling, trying to get high Everyday pause is trying to get right Lonely and lost, trying to get by Nobody know if I'm doing alright Nobody know that I put up a fight Good morning guys, it is Sunday I was not sure if I was gonna vlog another day for this vlog because I haven't started editing it yet but I'm worried it's not really <laughs> it felt kind of choppy filming it and it also just felt like I just wasn't really like super energetic and like happy and positive but I just think like that's the reality of right now because I'm just setting all day and I'm alone all day and it's like all very Blah. But I guess I'm gonna vlog some of today. Today is Sunday, so I vlogged on Thursday. Friday, I didn't really study that much. I studied for maybe an hour. And then my boyfriend came over, and then he was here. We were just like spending time together Friday night, Saturday, and then he left today at like 6 a.m. So that is like my weekly social interaction which is crazy so i'm like feeling refreshed and today is gonna be a study day a prepare for my rotation starting tomorrow and just kind of like sunday reset a bit so i thought i would vlog a little more and just be like very candid and honest with you all you know that's just the vibe right now so I'm gonna eat breakfast. I was originally gonna make myself some avocado toast, but I think it's gonna take up too much time and I just like don't wanna waste time. So I think I'm gonna make these instead. I love these things. Spanico pizza. I'm gonna make that and then I've already studied today for one 50 minute Pomodoro session. I did all of my new Anki cards. So I'm gonna pop these in the oven and then do another session for my reviews and hopefully i can finish all of them within 50 minutes but we'll see and yeah just keep going with the day so if you're still watching the vlog thanks for joining me for this sunday and let's go what happens when the world ends at least this is a no It's an awful house And I want it to get you out I'm working on a plan right now To come through I've waited for a lifetime for you To calm down Oh, nothing feels the same without you That I'm afraid But we can make it go away I hope you hear the things I say When I'm choked up next to you
feels the same without you now I just finished eating. It's 4.18. I finished Anki. Anki's the worst part of my day. So glad that that's done. And then I started Your World, but I haven't finished it yet. So I'm gonna finish that now. Put another load of clothes in the washer. I'm also about to study with my friend who is doing her dedicated from California. We're gonna study on Zoom, FaceTime, whichever but hopefully we like don't actually talk and we actually study. I'm in the middle of doing a 20 question set U World and I just did like random topics, but I'm gonna do another 20 set for all cardio topics because the rotation that I'm starting tomorrow is the cardiac ICU or intensive care unit. So I will be for some reason entrusted with taking care of the sickest patients in the hospital who specifically have cardiac issues. There's like I think like nine different ICUs at our hospital. I don't know if there's like other types elsewhere, but the one that I was put in was the cardiac one. And I think cardiology is sometimes can be a hard system because I think the physiology can be hard to understand. So, and like interpret when things go wrong. So I'm very nervous, very anxious, but I'm gonna do some prep today. Let's join this FaceTime call. <laughs> Hi. Hi. You know, I was doing laundry and my, my phone was on the charger. Huh? Are you in a car? Yeah, so I'm at the library. Oh. Feels the same without you. It's 12.17, it's super late and I am absolutely exhausted. I just got out of the shower and I'm in bed and I can't wait to close my eyes. I got a lot of stuff done today. I feel like I was so productive and I feel like I really needed that because I just was feeling like I had motivation but lacked the discipline to carry out the motivation to completion every day. And I think discipline has always been something that I've struggled with. I need to work really hard to improve my ability to exercise discipline, especially over the next seven weeks because I have to be studying for like the biggest exam of the year while taking care of the sickest patients in the hospital. Like, I don't know how we got here. <laughs> to be honest, I'm not the perfect student. If you've seen any other video, then you know that. And I struggle with that all the time. I finished U World, the cardio dedicated U World that I did. I did 20 questions of all cardio. Rocked me a bit. It's the worst score I've gotten in two months, which is, <laughs> like maybe not making me feel great about tomorrow but it's fine i'm gonna go in there i'm gonna try my best okay i'm gonna try my best i'm gonna try my best i have a list of things that i want to review and the original plan was to review them before starting the, my first day but i didn't get to really do that so i'm gonna be doing that i guess throughout the week i'm just praying to god they don't make me try to read an EKG tomorrow. Like, pl please. It is my, I think out of every single topic, every single thing you can ask me to do on the spot, that is the worst thing you could do to me. Like, I am not confident in my ability at all. Today I reviewed how hyperkalemia presents or high potassium presents on an EKG. And I'm like, maybe I could, pick that out tomorrow, but like anything else, unless it's like AFib, um, please don't ask me, please, please don't ask me. 
Uh, Anyways, the Dedicated Diaries is officially paused. I guess this is like mid-season finale. Not really. It's nowhere near the mid-season, but we're pausing because it's time to do a clinical rotation vlog in the next video, which will be me in the cardiac ICU, which is so crazy. I have to be there tomorrow at 8.30 a.m., which is so nice. I never thought I would say that that was late in relative terms, but that's like such a nice time. Like it really could be so much worse. It really could be 6 a.m. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm interested to see how it's gonna turn out. Wish me luck tomorrow. I'll bring you along at some point. I might make a channel announcement, but I think just with everything going on, I'm probably not gonna be posting every week, which I've already missed every other week for the past two cycles. But I think I'm gonna move to every other until I take a step and then I'll go back to every week. It's just, I'm kind of like trying not to drown here. Thank you for watching so much. Uh, if you liked the video, then please like the video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. Definitely stay tuned for the fourth year clinical content. It's my first clinical day of fourth year tomorrow and my last real first day as a student of any kind ever in my life, which is an amazing thing that I can say since I've been a student for basically 25 years. I will see you all in the next one. Bye.